Oh, do I start it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> start us off. I was like, Priya, what's taking so long? Hi there, I'm Faith Robertson with Organize with Faith. I'm Priya Krishna. I am the author of the cookbook in Danish and a contributor to The Times. And we are about to tackle her refrigerator. I feel the tears are coming. And I'm gonna to try to keep it cool. Damn, do you I need a napkin. Yeah, I can see that right there. Looks like it's seen better days. You just swirl. This is gonna just put your butt. I'm daunted for you. <laughs> no. I first saw her refrigerator in a consultation. I almost had a mini panic attack. And then here's the okay. face. So this is a mess. Like, I how can you find anything in here? Like Dark yeah. hole, yeah, it's like an abyss. Yeah, I do a lot of recipe testing in my kitchen. It can be really stressful. Like, things are like, get completely forgotten. And then like, one year later, we like unearth it. <laughs> I come from a family where we use literally everything. Yeah. You don't yeah. throw away a single thing. Yeah. Like, yeah. And so I'm like very sensitive to food waste. And whenever something goes bad in the fridge, I get- Like a part of you dies. Yeah, it's like yeah. a part of me dies. <laughs> Organization is not my strong suit, but I'm very, I'm like very willing and ready to learn. It's not just about organization, but it's also about creativity. Like mm -hmm. if you can put that basil in a tea or if you mm -hmm. can repurpose, you know, and put it in something else, you're thinking of how can I employ this produce in multiple yep. ways. Oh, and there's the pie. <laughs> the pie is ready. All right, so I think I'm ready to get started, Miss Priya. All right, yeah. do your thing. Yeah. I'm really excited. Thank you for being here. <laughs> Seth, you can come take the pie out. Yeah. <laughs> you guys have to see this pie. <laughs> So we're just gonna take a peek. We have lots of condiments. You know, the oldies but goodies. There's some peanuts. You refrigerate peanuts? Yeah, we refrigerate peanuts. Oh. And keep some fresher. Well, you learn something new every day. I need to refrigerate my nuts. <laughs> lots of beverages, right? Like it, it just feels like they're kind of monopolizing the space. We're just gonna bring some of these things to the light. First thing I'm gonna do, and the first thing that I always do, is just take everything out. I'm just gonna group those things so we have an idea of what we have. So much, I mean, the milk is like the thing. <laughs> and I'm not even like trying to throw shade. I, I really mean, I've never seen so much milk without a baby. <laughs> this is like an aisle at a grocery store. Yeah. <laughs> oh, wait, one more. What's your favorite hot sauce for you? Shaquanda's hot pepper sauce, if you ever had it. Oh. We have disinfecting wipes too. I think we need that. Let me get you this. I personally wipe my refrigerator down right before I go grocery shopping. I clean my refrigerator out, I wipe it down, so then I know kind of what I'm going to get. And I clean food going into a clean fridge. just a normal everyday person thing. It's important that you are compassionate towards yourself when you're organizing your kitchen and knowing that you're going to try out a lot of different things and some of them are going to work and you're going to be like, ah, I'm genius. And then some of them aren't and you're going to be like, oh shoot, I have to try again. I'm excited. <laughs> it worked. Y'all, I think this is going to work. If this works, So a lot of times when people are like, no, I would never do that, um, there's really no rhyme or reason to it other than that's the way they've always done it. But if you're really being intentional about what you're trying to create in your refrigerator, you're open to change. Oh goodness. Okay, wait, I need to have some changes now that I've found the yogurt. Oh no, she's learning about my yogurt. <laughs> How many glasses of milk do you drink today? Yeah. You guys have to see what I got because I kind of felt like that may be the move, like that would be the moment. I don't know who Lazy Susan was. It's like the only thing you need. We had all those condiments that were like exploding on the side of the refrigerator. They're practically all in this one Lazy Susan. They're pretty much all right here. Vaughn, do you see this? You just swirl. Not gonna cry about a lazy Susan, but I feel the tears are coming. And I'm gonna try to keep it cool. I need 
the napkin. I am tearing up because I'm so excited about it. But she says that she would like her produce front and center, which I agree, that's how I am. I wanna see my fruits and vegetables. I don't want them like way at the bottom. It's not inspiring at all. This is a produce bin. And inside, have you guys seen this? Inside. Oh wait, it's taped shut. Oh shoot, I got all excited to show you and now we have to take a beat. You don't know where these things have been. You know what I mean? Like who's touched them? This comes out and you can rinse them, let them dry and then put them out, put them straight away in. Doesn't that look like food you wanna eat? Priya, look at this. Oh my God. I know, I know, it's great. You keep your garlic in the refrigerator too? No, we don't. What, is there garlic in the fridge? Yes. We do not keep our garlic in the fridge. <laughs> okay. Come up with. All right, so here we are. This is where we're at right now. I'm a little concerned because I don't want things to get lost in the sauce. All right, I think I did it. Oh my God, is this ice cream? Yeah. I'm gonna like cry. It was in it. Seth made this. Wait, we just have to do this for a second. Did he make the, <laughs> did he make the jam to the, I need a napkin. Yeah. Like I really love food and so when I just meet people who go above and beyond, <laughs> just, just makes me so excited. God bless Seth. Some yummy ice cream in here. This side here is a little intense. Did you guys make this bread? Yeah. Seth. Ooh, cookies. Who raised this man? <laughs> this is a little tricky. Are these buns? Um, yeah. Is he okay with this? Oh, yeah. I kind of move fast because I don't want to do with that. The shelf extends. That makes a lot of sense. Oh my goodness. All veggies. We have all these ice packs. Up what I'm putting down. Look at that. Do you see that right there? Do you see it? Just right there. Just easy to grab. <laughs> Where are you from? And how did you get into baking? And you just clean for fun? <laughs> <laughs> okay, we're done. We did it. Oh my god. I'm so excited. <laughs> I am so excited too. I want to see. I want you to see it. Here you go. I'm going to oh, come on this side. Oh, wow. wow. <laughs> know where things go, you kind of have your condiments grouped yep. together, and you have your produce grouped together, and your jams grouped together, so it'll just be a little bit easier as you're shopping to navigate. Everything yes. is right there. It's great. This, this is, is great. Refrigerator Lazy Susan is like next level. Yeah, this is amazing. <laughs> <laughs> right? Really, like this freezer especially, has just like never looked disorganized. It's truly, it's like usually it's just like a jumping around where I lose things. Our freezer is <laughs> 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 cookies are easy access. I love it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Best of luck on your cooking and your baking. <laughs> <laughs> Can I try some ice cream? Oh, oh there's two crumble. quarts of the crumble one. <laughs> so um I'm back. I just had to make a couple of adjustments because Priya went grocery shopping and I was like, we need a little bit more space for produce. And then we kept the Lazy Susan with the condiments. We just knew that most of the beverages were gonna go here. We committed to that. And then we did the labels here. There you go. So if you see, here's the Lazy Susan here. Do you see that? 